Hello Kansas City Chiefs fans. How are you? I'm here today to share with you some incredible news about one of the most important trades the team made last year, and how it helped our team win its second Super Bowl title in the last four seasons. The Kansas City Chiefs' decision to acquire W.R. Kadarius Tony last season was indeed a wise and strategic choice. And now, with the 2023 NFL Draft in the books, we can say that this trade was a real success. The Chiefs traded their number 100 and number 209 picks to the Giants in exchange for Tony, who became a key weapon in our offense. But the story doesn't stop there. The Giants ended up trading the number 100 pick to the Las Vegas Raiders for T.E. Darren Waller. And believe it or not, that trade ended up helping the Chiefs in an even more surprising way. The Raiders used pick number 100 to select Cincinnati W.R. Trey Tucker, but that pick turned out to be a bit redundant for them as they already had Hunter Renfro working the slot. Meanwhile, the Giants ended up getting a new tight end in Daniel Jones with the trade for Waller. And what does that mean for the Chiefs? Meaning that, in the end, our strategic choice ended up weakening an AFC West opponent by proxy as a bonus to the whole thing. That is, in addition to acquiring an incredible player for our attack, we ended up taking one of the Raiders' weapons, which could be an advantage for our team in the coming seasons. But most importantly, the Chiefs' trade for W.R. Kadarius Tony was a real success. Tony contributed to our second Super Bowl title in four seasons and has become one of the cornerstones of our offense. And now, with the exchange of Raiders and Giants, we can say that this choice was even more strategic and beneficial for our team. Therefore, I urge you Kansas City Chiefs fans to subscribe to our channel and leave your comments below. We want to know what you thought of this exchange and how you believe it can impact our team in the coming seasons. Together, let's keep cheering and celebrating our victories.